Hey, how's it going? And today I want to show you how to create crosshairs in the first person blueprint in Unreal Engine 5. And I was inspired to do this because if you're following this tutorial around the UMG UI inventory, they get to a point about the 13 minute mark where they come across the function that draws the crosshairs and it's not in here. So I'll show you how to create this really fairly simply. So here we are in Unreal Engine and I'm just going to go ahead and start a new project. We'll go to the first person template and it's going to be just take a second to load up understanding the umg is really important because it has just so much application okay so here we are so what i'm going to do is i'm going to go into the first person blueprints here and i'm going to right click and i'm going to blueprint class and instead of going to actor like we usually do we're going to search for the hud class and go to hud right here and go select and we can name this whatever you want but probably bp first person HUD. And then before we get forget, we want to actually set once that's saved, it is it save all? We'll save all here real fast. We can come over into our world settings and under game mode, selected game mode. We want to switch it now from the HUD to the first person. Otherwise it won't work. And then let's just go ahead and go into this. This will just take a minute to do this. Oh I'm sorry, not that one. We don't want the first person character. We want the one we just did here. This one. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and dock this. So all we do is go into the event graph. We don't need any of this stuff, so we'll delete that. Then we'll right click and we're going to go event receive HUD draw. Now this functions as a tick, so it's self-driven and it's constantly sending out a pulse basically. So what we're going to do is we're just going to drag off of this and go to draw texture. This one right here. And then for size, we're just going to right click here and go to the div function. And this is basically going to center it. So we can copy this or duplicate it, get two of them. And so we just wire this into here and wire this into here. And the same thing here, wire this one in. Oops wire that one in and wire this one in here. Whoops, gosh, I'm missing my marks here today. So this is kind of a mess right here. Let me straighten these nodes out a little bit and then here we're going to divide by two so what this is going to do is center it right in the middle of the screen and you may want to offset that ultimately and then this is important we need to enter some values in here the screen is going to be 16 pixels by 16 and then under uv texture and width we have to put in one tab and one and then all we have to do is fortunately there is already crosshairs in here so if you come down and scroll down you'll find this one right here and that's all you have to do and we should go compile and save and then if we go into our oh there's one other thing i forgot under here color we want make linear color and these all should be one so one oops one tab one tab one tab like that and that should be all we do then compile and save and we go into first person we hit play there's our crosshairs right there and it's as simple as that and of course you can resize that with all the controls and everything else so anyway i just wanted to make this quick video to complete the other tutorial in the series so thank you for it very much and if you're not subscribed please do that inspires me to keep creating these tutorials thank you very much and have a great day